What's good YouTube, it's Chuka the Barber. I'm here with a new video. And today I'm gonna show y'all how to knock out a cut in about, I mean, this cut probably took me about 25, 30 minutes. I mean, quick fade, uh, clean fade. And this is my technique, this is how I knock these out. Okay, we got it dark on the top. I'm putting that first guy line in. And uh, this is gonna be like a mid to high fade, but I'm gonna give myself some space to blend and drop it slightly in the back, but it's not gonna be a drop fade. Um, and I'm using these bevel trimmers to, uh, you know, get my initial guy line in it. And I'm going to follow up with the shavers. Okay, get it to the skin. Now, once that's done, I'm going to start blending with my Andes Masters lever all the way closed. I'm taking it up just slightly, but I want to make sure this bottom part is real tight. So, after I do this, you know, this one adjustment with the whoa, this lever closed, you know, I'm gonna get it as uh, clean as possible, but then I'm gonna follow up with the trimmer to make sure that that line is completely out. I start my blend off right, okay? You always wanna start off on the right foot, so make sure that bottom part is handled, you know what I mean, before you start moving on to the next. All right, then I'm slightly opening up my lever, and then I'm blending my way up. This is my technique. This is how you, uh, I blend closed to open, and then when I put on the guard, I blend open to closed. All right, so we are gonna keep this bottom part real tight. Make sure I get all dark spots on out before I move on to the next adjustment. That way I have less cleanup work and I'm able to keep my systematic cutting method cons consistent. All right. I'm not all over the place. I'm following my guidelines. I'm creating new ones and I'm making sure that I fully blend it out before I move on to the next adjustment or the next step. All right. Level all the way open, taking it up some more. You can see how the blend's coming together there. lever all the way open with a 1 16th guard this is a zero guard and I'm taking it up some and this is what I mean like when I start I blend lever open to close when I throw on the guard because now you can see this is my first step with the guard and I have the lever all the way open when I had no guard I started off with it closed and now I could take like with the guard on I could take the blend up higher so I'm basically creating a new guideline and I can take it up higher because I'm gonna blend my way down, right? So um, now I'm gonna close it about halfway and blend below that last guideline and just watch the blend come together. I mean, this is how I'm able to knock my fades out quickly um, just by uh, doing this technique. I mean, it just kind of comes together, letting the tool do the work. You know, I'm just guiding it. All right, now I got the one eighth guard on. This is a, a one guard. 1 8 lever open and I'm gonna do the same thing that I did with the previous guard take it up some and we getting closer to the crown area so you know I want to keep it dark there so I'm not gonna go in I'm still keeping my, my my silhouette my structure to the cut all right and then I close the lever about halfway and then I blend below that now, I don't know if I mentioned at the beginning or if it had me cutting the top well there's a quick clip of me cutting the top at the beginning so the top is a, a number four guard and i start with the lever open go over it as it lays down then i'll throw close the guard the one the fourth the number four guard some to actually like lay down even cleaner so that's the length of the top uh, just in case i missed that but here now i'm gonna just follow up with some shear work some uh shear over the comb i want to give you my book for free so you can get the rich barber method how to attract clients keep them in charge more for free so after you're done watching the video go to the description Click the link and download the book for free, all right? It'll be game changing for you, really helps you build a solid foundation to your business so you can actually build a solid business that you're in control of to where you're able to build a future that you desire and it's all by design. It ain't no random shit or nothing. You don't wanna start your barber career doing random shit, not really clear on the direction and the type of business you wanna build. You wanna make sure that you're in control, that you build a foundation where you're able to attract clients, keep them, and scale your prices throughout your career to reach your ultimate goal, all right? So make sure you get that book for free after you're done watching the video. Work, um, do a little touching up, a uh, little blending with the clip over comb before I line them up. Make sure those hairs are comb combed all the way down. And we gonna tap that hairline. Bam. 
hit that corner. A little more clipper over cone. I like using the shears, I like using the trimmer, you know, I like using the clippers also to do clipper over comb. So depending on what you prefer, you can do either one or do both. Alright. Now we're gonna blend out the other side. Now we're gonna use the same technique. We're gonna run through this pretty quick though. Alright, so I got the bevels put into my first initial guideline. Well, right here I just took it up a little bit with the bevels, followed up with the shavers. Okay, um, and then now I got the lever closed with the masters. And I'm blending that out and blending that up, okay? And each time I blend it up, I'm creating a new guideline, making sure that the blend is tight before I make the adjustment. And I'm just working my way up, starting with the lever close to open. All right. Bam, you can see the fade coming together. the corner of the blade to knock out any dark spots checking my work through the mirror now I got the 116th guard on doing the same thing I did on the other side taking my blend up with the lever open and then I'll work my way down by closing the lever watching that blend come together Doing some shear over comb, blending that into the crown area, making sure that transition is nice and consistent. All right, blending that back all the way together. You see, I blended half the head at a time, so the back we want to make sure that we blend it all the way into the other side so that it's consistent and blend it all the way through and we're using the blend from each side to gauge the blend in the back to bring that together so you play off that side blend all right some detail work the other side of the line and we just tapping his line you know we, we we just tapping it he comes in every week so you know his line is never really like grown out much you know we're giving out world-class service treating our clients like royalty that's what i talk about in the rich barber method it's so important to have a world-class experience and treat your clients like royalty so if you want to learn more about that make sure you click the link in the description and get the rich barber method all right i'm giving it away for free for a limited time so make sure you snatch that up okay read that apply it if you got any questions hit me in the comments and i'll hit y'all back all right we're gonna take the rich barber razor holder with the rich barber razor blades and we're gonna hit that hairline stretch right now like right. tapping that line a little more you know making sure I comb out all the hairs make sure that I get everything that's sticking out so you might want to you know you need to comb it a lot you know and tap it consistent you know throughout the cut if you need to because I'm not going back into the line much I'm kind of just letting it hang slightly but still controlling the hair all right so I'm gonna take the enhance Hair fibers, we're taking dark brown, we're gonna fill in his lineup. And uh, although he's very lightly thin on the sides, this still brings it out. I mean, and he love it, he uses it himself in between cuts because it just bring out the look. 
the crazy is it's crazy how simple details simple additions uh you know really really create that feeling you know what i mean i'm gonna follow up with the trimmers and we pretty you know we, we we down the home stretch now all right so um last finna go over the top once i'm done with this freehand the top Make sure to like, comment, subscribe. Give me any feedback. Let me know what type of videos y'all want me to see. Make sure you stay tapped in, all right? And make sure you get your free book, The Rich Barber Method, in the description. Click the link, study the book, apply the method, and get your money, all right? It'll change your life, it'll change your career, it'll change your future. It's Chuka the Barber, I'm out.